guys' overall thoughts on uh, what, what's going on so far? I mean, overall thoughts is, you know, I'm enjoying this process of getting new coaches and stuff. Um, I, I'm enjoying coming back on the field. You know, I've missed, you know, so I missed all the spring ball, so that kind of sucked. And so, you know, getting back out with the, with these guys and, you know, just enjoying practice finally, you know, not sitting on the sideline. It's just, it's just been, it's way more fun, I should say. What does, Take it, what does it feel like to be back? Do you feel like you're at full speed right now? Uh, I, I feel like I'm around 85% right now. Um, I'm definitely getting there and I'm, I'm rehabbing it. I'm rehabbing like three times a day. So I'm just trying to get back to 100%. Um, I don't know how long it'll take, um, but you know, I'm, I'm, I'm working to get there. Take us back through when you, just kind of your injury and coming back from it and when you kind of determined you'd be able to be ready for fall camp given that it wasn't a certainty by any means. Yeah, so I, I broke my foot in, uh, during winter workouts and I mean instantly right there I got an x-ray and, and the doc told me that I was going to have to sit out all the spring ball. Um, and so, I mean, and that one hurt, um, but I, I, and he didn't give me it like when I was going to be back or when I was going to be able to be back. Um, so I kind of was just taking it week by week and, um, you know, just trying to fix my foot up and, and do the rehab, do everything I could to try to get it back. Um, and just, you know, luckily enough, I, I went in for one last, you know, checkup and he was like, you're, you're good for fall camp, you know, slowly work into it. And I'm like, great, you know, <laughs> I'm glad to be back. How excited are you? I mean, you're wearing the white shirt still, but you're participating. How, how exciting is that for you? It's so exciting. I'm just, like I said, I'm just happy I'm out here with my guys, you know, working and getting better, you know, because I'm excited for the season. I'm excited for our first game. And, you know, I'm just excited to get out here and get better with my team. What did you learn during that time off during spring ball? From time off? I, I learned that you know sitting out sucks I mean I, I hate that and you don't really you don't really feel the passion for the game until you sit and watch your teammates you know play and especially going from playing and then not playing for you know months on end um, and not knowing when you're gonna come back was was even worse so you know that's just kind of where I'm at. David the new coaching staff talked a little bit about that they hadn't really gotten a chance to see you and Jalen together in the uh, secondary now now that you're back on the field how have you guys kind of started to gel and have you gotten any kind of encouragement from coach Tibisar or anything like that? Um, I mean, I'm just, I'm, I'm just taking it day by day and, you know, looking at my playbook and, you know, J-Mo and I, we've been uh, looking at our playbooks together. Um, that's just kind of what we, we've done that since I was a freshman. He was always the first one to help me and, and really help me gel with the playbook. And, and with this new schemes that we're getting, you know, it's definitely nice to have him who, who went through spring ball and who understood the defense um, help me, you know, get to that same level. So, I mean, that's kind of how we're meshing. Um, coaches and I, they're just, you know, scouting me. I'm just trying to come out here and, you know, show them my best, the best that I can do. As a leader, I mean, you're a young guy. Just talking with Key too. I mean, you guys as sophomores are kind of forming into a leadership role already. What, what's that been like for you? Do you feel like you're taking on the leadership role? Yeah, definitely. I feel like, you know, especially with these freshmen coming in, I'm definitely having to take over and, you know, take the knowledge I'm getting from Jalen and passing it down and, you know, and taking the knowledge I'm gaining myself as well and passing it down and just kind of knowing and learning what I've learned from last year and, you know, kind of just applying it to, um, you know, everyone. I mean, I learned a lot from Manasse as well. And, you know, he was a he was a big leader for us last year. And so, you know, I'm just trying to take, I took, you know, tips from him and, and I, I kind of talked to him before he left on, you know, how, how he led the team. And, um, you know, I'm just, you know, I'm gonna try to do it, you know, my way but also you know takes take stuff from him and apply it to this team as well. Thanks David.